There cannot be too much content about off-road vehicles and all-terrain machines. This video will be the volume 2 of Mud, Sand and Rock Madness. We will be showing you all new pickup trucks with rugged suspensions, high-performance side-by-side vehicles, powerful SUVs and so much more. So subscribe to Automotive Territory for a regular dose of off-roading videos and enjoy the ride. Resvani Vengeance The American manufacturer of armored civilian vehicles, Resvani Motors, introduced the most sizable and priciest vehicle based on the Cadillac Escalade SUV. Designed by a digital artist, Milan Ivanov, the Vengeance boasts a striking appearance reminiscent of a game vehicle. The benefits of riding on an Escalade platform include an independent suspension with magnetic ride control technology, 10-speed automatic transmission, and four-wheel drive. Engine choices will be split between two 6.2-liter V8 gasoline engines producing either 420 or 682 horsepower, along with an optional 3-liter 6-cylinder diesel engine delivering 277 horsepower. Equipped with 35-inch tires and a mechanical limited slip differential, the Vengeance will easily conquer challenging off-road terrains. The passenger compartment features the same futuristic dashboard as the Escalade and offers seating for up to eight passengers across three rows. The Vengeance is custom built upon request and carries a premium price, surpassing the Resvani tank. The base price starts at $285,000 and if properly armored and accessorized, can reach a maximum of 800 grand. Polaris Expedition Polaris is making one more entry to the history books by introducing a new class of vehicles that they are calling Adventure Side-by-Sides. The all-new Polaris Expedition XP and ADV combine off-road capability of a side-by-side -side with the cargo capacity and flexibility of an SUV and a pickup truck. The Expedition is the first side-by-side -side to offer a fully enclosed cabin with the roof, windows, and an optional heating, ventilation, and air conditioning system. The ADV provides even more storage with a fully covered pass-through rear cargo box, offering up to 36 inches of length for the two-seat model and 63 inches for the five-seater. In turn, the XP has a 30-inch long dumping cargo box. The Polaris Expedition Adventure Vehicle maintains its serious off-road capability with a 114 horsepower engine, over 200 miles of range, 30-inch crawler XP tires, Fox Podium QS3 shocks with position-sensitive spiral technology. It features raised air intakes, sealed electrical components, and an optional 4,500-pound HD winch for tackling the muddiest of terrains. The Expedition's flat roof can accommodate more than 100 rack accessories packaged by Polaris for different activities, and also has a 2,000-pound towing capacity for off-road camping trailers. Lexus GX After more than a decade without a major redesign, the GX arrives all new with completely original appearance. The previous crossover vibes have gone down in history, as the 2024 GX adopts utilitarian SUV looks with boxy shapes, angular hood, and a more vertical windshield. The brand signature spindle grille still dominates the front of the GX, though it becomes less prominent, being carefully integrated with the upright design of the front. The new flattened tailgate features a full-length light bar positioned underneath the large power-operated rear window that opens separately. Underpinned by a new platform, the 2024 model is loaded with modern technologies like a 12.3-inch digital multi-information driver display, a 14-inch infotainment system with wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, and a 10-speaker stereo system. Optionally, you can add a smartphone charging pad or replace the stock stereo with the premium 21-speaker Mark Levinson surround system. Under the hood, the GX comes standard with a twin-turbocharged 3.4-liter V6 engine that delivers 349 horsepower and 479 pound-feet of torque. It's mated to a 10-speed automatic transmission and a full-time four-wheel drive system. Toyota Tacoma Entirely new for 2024, Toyota's mid-size bestseller is ready to further enhance its leading status on the US market. 
The new generation is underpinned by TNGAF architecture, which has already been used in the recently redesigned Tundra and Sequoia. The upgraded chassis is stronger and lighter, enabling improved handling of the truck's increased power and advanced off-road capabilities. The 2024 Tacoma has a relatively restrained appearance, with slimmer and high-positioned LED headlights, a slightly wider hexagonal grille, and high mount air intakes. A total of eight trim levels will be offered for the new 2024 truck, with four powertrain options and manual transmission available on some trims. The base turbocharged 2.4-liter inline-four engine offers three guises, delivering from 228 to 278 horsepower. The most capable Tacoma drivetrain is the 2.5-liter iForce Max Hybrid that outputs 326 horsepower and 465 pound-feet of torque. However, the biggest news is the availability of not one but two off-road models, including the all-new factory-built Trail Hunter. The latter comes with an OME suspension kit by ARB, 2.5-inch forged monotube shocks, skid plates and rock rails, 33-inch Goodyear all-terrain tires, and a bed utility bar with removable MOLLE panels. We are having fun covering off-road vehicles, but are you a fan as well? Let us know by smashing the like button and leave a comment below saying I want more if you want us to deliver more off-roading content. Let's proceed! Honda Pioneer 1006X Deluxe Crew Exploring the countryside with friends is made easier with the new Pioneer 1006 Deluxe Crew, which seats six and boasts perhaps the best second row in the segment. If compared to brand's Pioneer 5-seater, the 1006 has its wheelbase stretched by 35 inches, which means that the second row passengers are provided with 28 inches of knee room. In addition, the rear center seat is pushed a bit forward to minimize the possibility to hit each other's shoulders on extreme terrains. Honda fitted their new model with the reliable 999cc twin-cylinder engine backed with fully automatic six-speed dual-clutch transmission and improved gear ratios. The flagship powertrain along with thicker tubing in the chassis allows the six-passenger Pioneer to retain a full-size cargo bed and a 2,500-pound towing capacity. As standard, the 1006 Deluxe Crew gets 14-inch aluminum wheels, electric power steering, a new tow haul mode, and 210 millimeter hydraulic discs at all four corners. GMC Sierra HD AT4X The ability to tow 18,000 pounds and climb rocks is rarely requested by truck drivers, but that is exactly the kind of service offered by first ever AT4X within the GMC's heavy duty lineup. This flashier alternative to the Chevy Silverado HD gets its only available on the 2500 HD truck, configured with the crew cab body style and the standard length cargo bed. It rides on 18-inch wheels wrapped in chunky 35-inch Goodyear Territory MTs. There are steel front and rear bumpers, with winch accommodation, tougher underbody armor and exclusive parts from aftermarket supplier AEV. This off-road semi-truck boasts a 1.5-inch raised suspension supported by advanced Multimatic DSSV spool valve dampers and an enhanced front suspension. The truck's standard gas-fed V8 becomes more efficient and ditches the old 6-speed transmission in favor of 10-speed Allison Automatic, while the optional 6.6-liter Duramax V8 diesel has upgraded output of 470 horsepower and 975 pound-feet. The new Sierra 2500 HD AT4X includes sought-after features, like a 12.3-inch digital gouge cluster a 13.4-inch center touchscreen, and a convenient head-up display. Additionally, each model boasts luxurious elements, such as authentic wood interior trim, leather upholstery, front seats with massage functionality, and a high-quality 12-speaker Bose sound system. Land Rover Defender 130 Outbound Land Rover's new Defender 130 Outbound was specially developed for overlanding enthusiasts that need to reach faraway destinations, while carrying significant amounts of gear and retaining the most pleasant in-cabin experience. Even though this newcomer is built on the same long wheelbase as the 8-seater Defender, it is equipped with only 5 seats. The remaining space is reserved for an enlarged cargo space of 88.85 cubic feet. The cargo area spans over 50 inches and is prepared for the most demanding adventures. It is a near-flat loading space, 
multiple latch points, cargo nets, and durable floor mats that can even be unfolded to protect the rear bumper. If you want even more protection, Land Rover can apply an optional satin protective film for better scratch resistance. This SUV has three engine options to choose from. P400 gasoline and D300 diesel engines that feature a mild hybrid technology, as well as the most capable 5.0 liter supercharged V8. The V8 engine option comes with exclusive quad exhaust pipes and provides you with 493 horsepower and 450 pound-feet of torque. That's enough to complete a 0 to 60 mile per hour sprint in 5.7 seconds. The SUV's off-road capabilities are backed by an intelligent all-wheel drive system, an electronic air suspension and standard Goodyear Wrangler Dura-Track all-terrain tires. Finally, the cabin should be outfitted with either Windsor leather or durable resist fabric. The standard equipment includes four-zone climate control, Meridian sound system, interactive driver display, and an infotainment system with an 11.4-inch touchscreen. Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, and Alexa voice controls are supported too. GMC Canyon AT4X Decent sales numbers have allowed GMC not to revamp this mid-sized truck for a decade, but in 2023, we are finally welcoming the third generation Canyon. The truck gets all new bones, beefed up proportions, wider tracks, and improved approach or departure or breakover angles. The newcomer will be sold in four trims, Elevation, Denali, AT4, and the first ever AT4X. The entire Canyon lineup is powered by a high output 2.7 liter turbo four mil, paired with an eight speed automatic transmission with two and four wheel drive types. This engine peaks at 310 horses, 430 pound-feet, and enables towing up to 7,000 pounds. Interestingly, GMC discontinued any other configuration of the truck, but the new crew cab short box with 5 passenger capacity and 62 inches of box length. The new flagship AT4X trim is set apart by a wider stance, 3-inch factory lift that contributes to a total ground clearance of 10.7 inches. With exclusive Multimatic DSSV shocks, significant underbody protection, 17-inch wheels, wrapped in 33-inch Goodyear Wrangler Territory empty tires, and up to 10 camera views, rock climbing with the GMC Canyon is no longer out of the picture. Lastly, the outdated cabin of the Canyon is significantly freshened up, and now offers an 11-inch instrument cluster, 11.3-inch infotainment, wireless smartphone connectivity, and Bose 7 speakers premium audio. The seats are leather-appointed, have 8-way power adjustability up front, and are heated and ventilated. Shelby F-150 Centennial Edition To commemorate Carol Shelby's 100th birthday, Shelby American is producing a special run of 100 Shelby F-150 trucks. Based on the Lariat's four-wheel drive supercrew trim with a short box, the Centennial Edition features an exclusive Shelby front grille, dual intake air hood, electric side steps, and unique front fenders. Completing the distinctive exterior are 22-inch Shelby wheels fitted with 35-inch BF Goodrich all-terrain tires. Off-road capability is enhanced with a several suspension upgrades, including BDS lift kit, 2.5-inch front and rear Fox shocks with adjustable dual-speed controls, and rear traction bars. For the asking price, the Shelby team also installed upgraded pads and rotors on the brakes, along with a performance-oriented exhaust system by Borla. The latter helps optimize airflow to the 400 horsepower naturally aspirated 5.0 liter V8, which is an optional engine on the standard Ford F-150. To add extra power, you can opt for a supercharger, performance air intakes, and high flow fuel injectors. This configuration raises the V8's output to a formidable 800 horsepower. Polaris Razor XP Redesigned from the ground up, the industry's best seller arrives with an array of performance upgrades and offers three versions, Sport, Premium, and Ultimate, and two-seat and four-seat body styles. Each RZR100 XP gets a more rugged exterior with a chassis-integrated front bumper, full-coverage skid plates, LED lighting, and full doors. The suspension system now offers up to 20.5 inches of usable travel, depending on the model, 
and also gets Walker Evans needle shocks that can be adjusted in 16 positions and measure 2 inches in diameter up front and 2.5 in the rear. The total ground clearance varies from 14 to 14.5 inches. The new RZR XP uses a second generation ProStar engine with 999cc displacement and 114 horses. In addition, the familiar CVT gearbox features better cooling, has lower gearing and gets a new automotive style shifter with a start in park mode. Depending on the chosen grade, the side-by-side -side brings 29 or 30 inch tires, analog dial with a 4 inch LCD or a 7 inch ride command display. Argo Centaur XT and Argo Sasquatch In North America, the world's original and most renowned amphibious all-terrain vehicle Sherp is sold under the Argo brand. The Centaur XT belongs to the commercial line of Argo products and is an equivalent to the Sherp N1200. It effortlessly maneuvers on any surface with its smooth hydraulic skid steering system, vehicle's patent suspension system, lightweight and elastic tires, and massive 71-inch tubeless ultra-low pressure tires. These massive rubbers are self-inflating and take 30 seconds to reach full pressure, eliminating the possibility of flats. The Centaur XT is powered by a reliable and fuel-efficient Dusan D18 diesel engine, known for its power, low noise, and vibration. It utilizes gears and oil bath chains to avoid slippage and sticking in extreme conditions. Additionally, each wheel embeds special canister fuel tanks, increasing self-sustainability and expanding the cruising range, with a total additional diesel fuel capacity of 61 gallons. Also, in 2023, Argo is developing a new version of this vehicle named Sasquatch, which will explore the concept of an amphibious pickup truck. It will get new patent-pending tires, HDT e-steer automatic transmission instead of the Centaur 6-speed manual, and will carry 57.5 cubic feet of materials and equipments atop Argo's Flexbox bed. If you have not seen the Volume 1 of this video, make sure to follow the link on the screen and check it out. There will be more crazy ATVs and powerful off-roaders. Before you go, smash the like button, visit the comments, and leave a comment, I want more if you'd like more content like this, and subscribe to Automotive Territory not to miss it. As always, may the torque be with you.